Swimsuit season is here and everyone is looking for a quick and easy way to shed a few pounds, right? But now one doctor is suggesting a new diet that will melt away those stubborn pounds. Literally, it's called the ice diet. Well, joining us live this morning to explain exactly what it is and how it works is Don Napoli. She's a registered dietitian with UF Health Cancer Center at Orlando Health. Good morning. Thanks for coming in. Good morning. Thanks for having the me. The ice diet. Okay, I'm a little leery. Tell us what this is. Okay, so the theory behind this is called thermogenics, and it's saying that your body expends so much energy or calories to melt the ice, so you're actually spending calories and not bringing in calories. So essentially you should lose weight. Yeah, because a lot of people think if you drink something cold, like cold water in the morning, it speeds up your metabolism and it helps you lose weight. But does this really work? Right, so theoretically, theoretically it should work because uh -huh. you are expending those energy. But truthfully, to lose a pound each week, you have to expend about uh, 3,200 calories. Uh -huh. And that equates to about nine pounds of ice per day. Nine pounds a day <laughs> yes. to lose one pound a week? Right. I don't know anybody oh. that can eat nine pounds of ice per day. No, that's all you would be <laughs> eating all day long is ice. No right. food, just ice. Right. It's a lot of ice. Even if you put ice in every single one of your drinks, yes. it's a lot of ice to be eating to really, you know, work. So, I mean, truthfully, you probably could turn the thermostat down a little bit or, you know, wear less clothing so that you're actually, you know, you're speeding up your metabolism uh -huh. that way and probably lose more weight than eating the ice. So if people want to attempt to do this nine pounds of ice a day, is it even safe to try and do something like this? You know, ice is safe as long as you're not chewing it, so you're not putting your teeth or your gums in damage and you're not eating too much ice, you're not, you know, eating ice when it's really cold outside, so you're putting yourself at a higher risk of hypothermia. Ice is safe to, to eat. It's not going to harm you, mm -hmm. but, you know, I don't think the nine pounds is really doable. Yeah. I mean, there are so many fad diets. These come and go all the time. Doesn't it basically come down to eat right and exercise and you'll slim down? Yeah. You know, I hate to be like the, the go back to everything, you know, that we've always talked about and be that kind of boring, you know, just eat right. But it but works. It really does work. And what you really should be having in your diet is helpful foods because you want your health to be good. So if your health is good, then your weight is going to be stable and manageable and you're going to be at a healthy weight. You're going to be physically fit by including your physical activity, your fruits yeah. and vegetables, your whole grains, getting your fluids in, all that together works to make you a healthy human being. Oh. So that is really what our goal should be. Yeah. Just go back to the basics. It works. Yeah. Don Napoli, thanks so much for coming <laughs> thanks. in. Thanks. Always good to see you. Have yeah. a great weekend. Thanks.